Next up, we have uh, Chad Hoyle and uh, Tyler Street. Making his way into the octagon was uh, Chad Hoyle. We didn't say anything about him because we were engaged in another conversation. But hey, here he is. I am, uh, you know, I'm just going to throw a shot out there that this is a heavyweight fight. I have that feeling. It is coming in here at 5'7, 235 pounds. Got a record of 0 2, Chad Hoyle. All right, here's the opponent. Weighing at 225 pounds, standing at 5'11, making his debut fight in the octagon tonight. Out of Taylorsville, North Carolina. Also fighting out here with Davis. What's wrong with that? What's wrong with that? Three! You know, I, I did uh, talk to Rick about uh, Tyler Threed here, and uh, Rick said that he is fantastic on the ground. Uh, an absolute great uh, jiu-jitsu guy, and uh, he is a, a decent ranked uh, jiu-jitsu black belt under Joe Hurst. And uh, I think we're gonna see some hands being that he is from Rick Davis's. Hey, is so this jiu-jitsu black belt under Joe Hurst? I'm not sure about the black belt. I think, I, I know that he just got a, a new ranking. I'm not sure what it was. I didn't really ask specifics okay. like that, but I do know he is ranked under Joe Hurst. And uh, he's highly praised, highly touted. And uh, not a lot of people have seen him do anything. I'm not sure if he does grappling tournaments, but uh, I've been sold on him. Interesting. Coming in here, making his debut. Be nice to find out what he can do here tonight up against Chad Hoyle. You know, I, I got to wonder, though, uh, if the experience Chad Hoyle is going to play into this. Uh, you know, he's had two fights, and he looks very relaxed right now. He does. Uh, I got a question, though. Uh, did, did he come in any corner, though? I, I saw the one guy uh, back there that's in his corner right now uh, fighting out of uh, a Bears den, I believe it is. I'm not real familiar with the school. Some, that guy, right over there on the right. You know, there's nothing really wrong with uh, Hoyle's uh, uh, fight record here. He's 0-2, but I mean, he fought, uh, one of his fights was against uh, Cliff Thompson. Cliff's no joke, former ECCF champion here. Oh, and Chad looks like he is ready to get this on. Both guys look pretty relaxed here in the cage. Uh, if they can find the uh, cage pin here uh, and get this on. I like seeing two guys like this, calm and collective. I just like seeing a guy with a ponytail get in there and fight. Yeah, nothing wrong with that. It's got a samurai feel to it. Samurai. I'm trying to grow my hair out. Really? I just cut my sarcasm. Chad <laughs> <laughs> Bryant needs a haircut. Yeah. Yeah. Definitely. All right, folks. We're it's about not like to be the, the light here. shining off his head's blinding or anything like that. Chad Hole coming out of the blue corner. Tyler Three coming out of the red corner. Looks like, it looks like we got a couple of south bars there, Anthony. That's, <laughs> that is rare. Like the only two heavyweights I know of on the card are both south bar. Oh, oh big wow. jump up from Chad Hoyle here. Got him in a, a wrestling head and arm choke right I here. would call this breastfeeding at this point. Ugh. Wow, yeah. <laughs> He is trying to, oh, he's putting some serious pressure on Tyler here. He is. Tyler doesn't look like he's fighting it off too well. He's trying to move the hips he needs out. To, he needs to keep moving that direction. He needs to keep moving around to his left. Oh, I don't know. And he needs to try he to looks wrap like a foot around Chad Hull. His face is getting a little bit red here. I wonder if Chad's just going to try and smother him out. He might. He doesn't need to wear himself out with that choke, though. Uh, I'm looking for a, a cross choke. face here. A cross face. Trying to break that grip. I know that's that's a lot of weight coming down on your head. Both these guys are heavyweights. It absolutely is. That's not that's not a strong choke, though. I I, uh, I don't want to see him sell out to that this early. He uh, yeah, himself. Yeah, you know, he would look back on that in shame, most likely. No, but it, it, it looks like it is. Chad has got a death grip right now. Yeah, he's going to slide out of that, and he could take Chad's back. He's still got the ponytail, though. You can finish a choke by the ponytail. And he's out. He's out. Looks like Chad Hull's on top at half guard. Looking like he's going to take his time. Tyler's trying to uh, bridge out of this here, you know. Uh, he's got to wonder if uh, Chad maybe didn't gas himself out. Oh, that's a foul. And that's... Tyler... 
Tyler looks like he's trying to push him off here. He's fighting strong. He's fighting good. He's breaking the grips. But Chad is just attack, attack, attack with these chokes. Chad's postured up. He lays down a strong punch. I, I, I think he's going to finish Tyler from this position. Well, it's going to be it's going to be hard to sweep him. You know, he obviously has like most of his weight is in the in the middle of his body. It's going to oh, be hard. There it goes. There it goes. Oh, and Tyler's laying down some punches now. Oh, and an ankle lock here. Oh, he's got a twist. He's going to have to twist to finish this one. Tyler's Tyler's switching it to the other arm. Oh, I like it. I like it. He's grimacing. Chad is grimacing. Chad's got to get out of there. He's going to get hurt. He's not fighting it off right here. He's not kicking or anything. He is just letting Tyler crank his hair. Conceding defeat a bit too early. I don't... You know, I just... I just think if he was more determined, he would have fought that a little bit harder or possibly gassed himself out trying to work those chokes early on in the fight. Absolutely. One thing you can definitely work on is uh, some heel hook or leg lock defense. It didn't look like he knew what to do there when he was caught. There's a guy he knew he was in trouble, him. but uh, he, he didn't find out of it. He just sat there. That's yeah. something he can work on in the near future. There, there's a man in, the stri in a polka dotted shirt right there. You're right crying right now in the book with a hat on. And he's walking away. You know, Chad came born on strong here. Uh, you know, the breast being choked was, it, it looked really close. Tyler's face was really, really red. And it looked like he did contemplate uh, tapping out to that there. It was real tight. But, you know, it's not something that's going to cut off a lot of blood. It's really, that's a pressure choke. Tyler, right? Yeah. You know, that's, it was more of a pressure on the head. That's, you know, it's not cutting off blood. It's not cutting off air. It is just pressure. Chad's uh, limping a little bit here. Your winner, 228 into the first round by Hill Hook, playing for the hands together, fighting out of the red corner, Tyler Three. Yeah, I did like uh, Tyler's transition to the heel hook. He, he went for a straight ankle lock, or an Achilles lock to some people, and then a switch sides and turned it into a heel hook. Thank you. 